Hello friends, in this video we are going to solve a question from quantum mechanics. This question is related to Schrodinger equations. So first read the question, a particle is moving in one dimension, has a ground state wave function uh, which is not normalized and do not normalize and which is given by this psi naught, this is the ground state wave function so we can just rewrite that psi naught is equal to e power minus alpha alpha to the power 4 x to the power 4 by 4 and where alpha is a real constant alpha is a real alpha is a real constant ok it is given and it belongs to energy eigenstate E0 this is ground state wave function and corresponding energy is given E0 is equal to h bar alpha square by m this is ground state wave function ground state wave function wave function ok so determine the potential in which the particles move so we need to find the potential ok so we know we know that Schrodinger equation we know Schrodinger equation that is nothing but h psi equal to e psi h psi equal to e psi where h is Hamiltonian operator Hamiltonian operator and e is the corresponding energy eigenvalue energy eigen value ok so here we know that Hamiltonian operator is nothing but minus h bar square by 2m d square x by d square x by plus v because we are dealing with 1d one one case so just substitute uh, psi naught and e naught into this into equation number one okay substitute okay substitute psi naught e naught into equation 1 so we get h h is minus h bar square by 2m d square by dx square that is second derivative plus v plus v which is acting on psi naught the value of psi naught is e power minus alpha power e power minus alpha to the power 4 x to the power 4 by 4 which is equal to e naught e naught is h bar square alpha square by m h bar square alpha square by m into psi naught e power minus alpha to the power 4 x to the power 4 by 4 okay so do this operate this into this and this into this we'll do this second differentiation for that first differentiate dy dx of e power minus alpha to the power 4 x power 4 by 4 which is equal to exponential function as it is e power minus alpha power 4 x power 4 by 4 
into minus into minus alpha to the power 4 by 4 into 4 x cube okay so this 4 and this 4 will get cancelled and what remaining is minus alpha to the power 4 x cube e to the power minus alpha to the power 4 x power 4 power 4 by 4 ok now d square by dx square of this quantity become equal to d by dx of this quantity ok so here we will use the product rule minus alpha to the power 4 we can take outside now this is uh, considered as a first function that is x cube into derivative of this which is e power minus alpha to the power 4 x to the power 4 by 4 into minus alpha to the power 4 by 4 into 4 x cube plus now this taken as as it is e power minus alpha to the power 4 x to the power 4 by 4 and differentiate x cube so we get 3 x 3 x square so now here this 4 and this 4 will get cancelled and this x cube and x cube become x to the power 4 okay so now this minus alpha to the power 4 and this minus alpha to the power 4 it become alpha to the power 8 okay x and x, x cube and x cube become x to the power 6 and this quantity is common so we can take outside plus uh, here it remaining is 3 x square sorry 3 this is 3 x square and there is there will be minus alpha to the power 4 so this become this plus sign become minus become minus alpha to the power 4 so this is the second differentiation so put in that into above equation then we get minus h bar square by 2m into alpha to the power 8 x power 6 minus 3 x square alpha to the power 4 there there will be e power minus that time also e power minus alpha to the power 4 x to the power 4 by 4 this is common time now write that also e power minus alpha to the power 4 x to the power 4 by 4 plus v into look at here v into that e power minus term e power minus alpha to the power 4 x to the power 4 by 4 which is equal to e which is equal to h bar square h bar square sorry h bar square alpha square by m into e, into e power minus alpha square alpha power 4 x power 4 by 4 so now so now this term this term this term common so they get cancelled and there is our objective that is v is here this is what we want to find so we take a v here and go this term to the right side right side then h bar square alpha square by m as it is then this term become plus h bar square by 2m into alpha to the power 8 x to the power 6 minus 3 x square alpha to the power 4 so this is the 
potential uh, uh, we need to find anyway we can uh, rewrite this as h bar square alpha square by m into 1 plus there will be 1 by 2 here and alpha to the power 6 x to the power 6 minus minus 3 x square alpha to the power 2 okay so this is the final answer I hope it is clear okay this is very the straightforward question from uh, related to Schrodinger equation if you like this video please share to your friends and subscribe this channel for more such videos thank you once again